times. It's a mixed bag of the elements as heavy snow, ice pellets, freezing rain and rain are moving through, canceling classes and flights. Across the region, a lot of people are growing weary of winter. As CTV's Jonathan McGinnis reports, it's the 15th storm of the season. Many parts of Canada are digging out from another winter snowfall, but Montreal is facing a different cleanup problem. Where to put all that powder? The usual sites used to dump all the snow are full. As Stéphane Giroux reports, while the search for new sites continues, Montrealers are getting used to looking at the kind of snowdrifts not seen in a decade. Coming up, more on the weather with a look at the national forecast, plus a story that was 700 dog years in the making. After more than three months of watching reruns, television viewers will soon be able to catch brand new episodes of their favorite TV shows. The Hollywood writers' strike is over. Union members, what kind of impact has this strike had on the industry? Well, on me personally, um, <laughs> I, only I could start writing a daily TV column during a period. For the writers, I mean, obviously they voted in favor of it. Well, it was a victory in the sense that they crippled. Well, from Star Trek to the new sci-fi film Jumper, you're probably familiar with the idea of teleportation. That's the movement of matter from one place to another without physically traveling the distance. Well, it turns out scientists have actually done real teleportation experiments in the lab. Suntia Reid explains. Let's turn our attention now to the weather with the national forecast details. Here's CTV's Dave Duvall. Dave? Thank you, Dave. Canine history was made last night. For the first time, a beagle was named best in show at the world's most renowned dog show. A House of Commons battle over the future of Canada's mission in Afghanistan continued during question period today. The opposition was shoring up their policy amid dissent, but as CTV's Roger Smith reports, the Conservatives went on the offensive, lobbing accusations of new questionable liberal fundraising tactics.